36 and seven of nine beyond the arc, 78% after winning the first game in the two game series. And there's Tibor Pleiss on the assist from Tyus Jones. A oh, good ball movement, right? Boise at the last game of the season versus them and back the other way to Rico White. Can't stop him, you can only hope to contain him. He's hit back-to-back -back jumpers over Earl Clark. That time goes for a little floppage. The referee says, I don't think so. And then you could say maybe it hasn't been that great, but the offensive ball movement, players going to the basket like right there. Man, that's just beautiful ball work, great penetration. And then two of eight is Tyus Jones. Down low, wow. scoring is Clark. The third one heading into the break, so Carter's got to play big over these next two and a half minutes, literally and figuratively. At six foot eight, he's going to have his hands full with a seven foot two. All right, Rick. Here's Ayers rejected by Clark. Ball's on the deck. Ayers threw it away. Tariko White with the one handed throwdown. Back in for the stampede. Here's pressing out, eight to shoot, three on the way, good from three land and for the stampede, four now for pressing and nice pass from Booker. That's, I mean, I talk about it all the time, but his ability to keep plays alive. Screen, Plyce wanted the ball, didn't get it in the corner. Jones, yes, he got it. For Idaho, we talked about how they were moving the ball and playing a great team game, but that's an assist right there that you're gonna see on all the highlights in the D-League as Jones wow. finds Williams with a two-handed dunk. That was a thing of beauty. Two in a row now with Canton coming into town Thursday. 